Hi everyone, this is Edwin Dearborn coming to you at the end of Tuesday and I wanted to talk to you about how to stop cursing Yelp as a small business owner and start leveraging your reputation management to attract more new customers. Of late I've seen on social media and over the last few months I've talked to some people that I've consulted with and they are not happy with Yelp. Now, I was on the phone this morning with Jazz Greer in the UK, and apparently Yelp is not as big as the UK. So I'm, I'm gonna be talking about Yelp, which is a, a review site, very popular in the United States with consumers, but what I have found is not that popular with small business people because they either find that a lot of their good reviews are not shown, and bad reviews go to the top. And bottom line is, small business people don't know how to really be at cause and be proactive with Yelp, and that's the real underlying problem. I give the analogy, if someone was to put poison in your pool, that your swimming pool, I can't go in and separate the poison from the water. But what I can do is put more pure water into the pool and flush out the bad reviews and eventually because I put more clean water the bad water doesn't as effect it doesn't affect you as much right because it's been diluted the best way to handle bad reviews on Yelp or any review site is to generate more positive reviews dilute the bad with more good reviews so really the question becomes how do I generate a lot of good reviews well, my company, Premier Lead Systems, within the next day or two, will be announcing Premier Reputation, which is it's gonna be a software that's going to allow you very inexpensively, and I mean very inexpensively, on a monthly basis, to automate and put a system for generating great reviews. Basically, what we're gonna do is we're going to remind your clients, your happy clients, through email and text, to leave a great review. Instead of waiting for them to go home and hope they leave that review, we're actually going to put something in their in basket, in their text, and remind them to not only leave a review on Yelp, but to leave that same review on other sites, such as TripAdvisor, your Facebook page, and Google My Business. Now, let me tell you the power of positive reviews and I think you already understand some of them but some of them you may not fully appreciate so let me just tell you what a positive review does number one it's social proof when people go to sites like Yelp Facebook and research for businesses on Google when they see a business with lots of good reviews that is social proof that your business is a good business so people trust peer-to-peer -peer or third-party reviews as they're referred to, much more than your own marketing. In fact, peer-to-peer -peer reviews is the most trusted content online. So you wanna be proactive in generating that on an ongoing basis. Number two, when people ask you, well, what has your company done for others? You can send them your reviews or send them to your Yelp site happily because you've got a lot of good reviews. So. Again, social proof on, you know, but this is where people are specifically asking you, why should I do business with you? Go to my Yelp page, go to my Facebook page, look at my reviews. You'll see that people are happy with me. Point number three, it has been proven in multiple studies that the more positive reviews that you have on Facebook, Yelp, and Google, it actually raises your rankings of your website. Google knows that if you've got positive reviews elsewhere, not on your website, but elsewhere throughout the digital ecosystem, they'll actually give you SEO credit and they'll rank your site higher. So it's good to, it's reviews are good to help rank your website. And point number four, and this is my favorite, you can fast track your SEO and your brand at the top of Google almost immediately with lots of good Google reviews because Google My Business is a Google product. And Google loves Google. In fact, Neil Patel, one of the leaders internationally in SEO, said that even today, and he's really good at it, it can take him up to a year to get a website to rank on page one of Google. 
And that's someone who's doing a really good job of it. So if it's taking Neil Patel minimally a year to rank a website, imagine how long it may take for your website to rank. But guess what? There's a way to fast track it. You've probably seen these little squares when you search for local businesses where it's Google, you know, the Google box, right? And it's got the link to the website and it's got their phone number and it's got their hours of, uh, you know, of operation and it's got reviews. Well, you, when you really fill out your Google My Business that box because it is a Google product, can go straight to the top for SEO purposes because Google loves to rank their own content. So your website may take years or even months to rank, but that box with lots of good reviews could rank in a matter of days or weeks or maybe just a few months. And that allows your business to get to the top of Google without having to rank your website. We call it the fast track system of SEO. Now, all these things are positive ROI actions. And I'm gonna tell you one specific story, and I won't mention the name of the company because she may not want me to, but this is a company that I've worked with for years, and they've got a lot of good Google reviews, like a lot, over 100. And one day we were doing an analysis of their income, like how much money do they make annually? And then from which resource? Do they get it from referrals? Do they get it from Facebook? Do they get it from the Yellow Pages, Yelp? Like, because every time they get a new client, they track exactly how that person found them. Well, what we found was is that they made over $700,000 in sales from people who found them on Yelp. $700,000, that's over $10,000 a week in gross revenue from people who found them on Yelp. But that was because they were proactive in getting lots and lots of good reviews. Now, imagine this, creating good reviews and it's evergreen content. Unless that person takes that review down, and most likely they won't, those good reviews are evergreen content, meaning they work 24 seven, they're there day in, day out, year after year, unless they're taken down. So it builds a cumulative effect the more reviews you get. Now, you're probably asking yourself, okay, Ed, this is all well and good, what should I do? You should be getting more reviews. And if you'd like to put this system into a system, meaning automate it with modern technology, so that you're getting reviews on a daily basis, you should contact me and letting me help you automate this marketing. Last point here, when you've got good reviews on a routine basis, this makes the best things to share on social media. Instead of posting those stupid cat videos or those political themes like I do, why not post good reviews of your patients or your customers? So imagine you're getting a good review every other day and your feed is showing new people with great five-star, four-star reviews on a continuous basis. What this does is this creates the impression, correctly so and honestly, that your business is doing good business with people, that it's doing good exchange, that it's making people happy, that it's rendering its brand's promise. Good reviews can sell your business much better than you can. So if you want to really take advantage of Yelp and, and, and Facebook reviews and Google My Business, I'm telling you, it does result in ROI. I know lots of businesses that are mastering this review management game. They're killing it. They're getting new customers on a daily basis because of it. And it is something that you need to take heed as a small business person. Even if you're a solopreneur working out of your home, you can create a lot of reviews with friends and family to begin with. And then as you get customers, you get your customers to leave reviews. And guess what happens? You're gonna be found like I'm being found online. So anyways, I hope you found this informative. Take note, online reviews can make or break a business. So why not have it make you more business and make you more money? Edwin Dearborn, author of Power Branding Secrets. If you need help in generating more positive reviews and just blowing open the doors to more customers, you should contact me. All right, we'll talk soon, bye-bye.